All right, so this next muscle that we're gonna be working is flexor hallucis longus. So flexor of the big toe. So the individual is going to try to curl their big toe at both the IP and the metatarsophalangeal joint. Then they're also gonna be doing some plantar flexion and a little bit of inversion. It's not the main part of this, however, the muscle does cross over those joints, so we'd like to see it. If you need to, you can hold their toes a little bit, but we're gonna ask the person to curl their toe. So there's the flexion and then a little plantar flexion and inversion, excellent. For the brake test, I want to put my pressure onto the distal phalanx of the big toe, uh, not grabbing the entire thing, but mainly resisting to the distal or near the insertion. We're going to bring them into a little bit of plantar flexion and inversion, and I'm going to say, don't let me move you as I push down. Thumb pressure should be more than enough. Three, two, and one. So that's for the full five seconds there. Now I'm going to start with his foot kind of more neutral. He's going to push, curl, curl. Great, all the way through that action. Now, our muscle starting in the leg and it inserts into the foot. So I'm going to start by extending the toe. So extension of the IP, the metatarsal phalangeal joint. I'm then gonna start to dorsiflex him and a little bit of eversion as the final length position for flexor hallucis longus.